Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Rosie O. And today I'm going to show you a painting I bought off of Amazon that I just really, really love. <laughs> and if you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for coming back. I really do appreciate it. Hey, if you're new to the channel, hope you enjoy the show. <laughs> oh, and if you can like and subscribe, I really appreciate that as well. <laughs> so right now Amazon is having kind of early breakfast. Black Friday, Prime Day type of thing. It's sales. <laughs> and a lot of diamond paintings have been discounted. So if y'all haven't had a chance, you should go check it out. There's so many different paintings that are being discounted. The painting I'm going to show today, because of course the painting, is one of the ones that they had kind of a small discount on a lot of diamond paintings before their whole Black Friday rollout. So I believe this painting is also still discounted and everything for this painting I'll make sure to put in the description below if maybe this image is a painting you would like to do yourself. <laughs> and it was such a small Amazon order so I only was able to get one painting. And uh, But since right now a lot of those sales are going on Amazon, especially if you have Prime, I think I'm going to try to pick up a couple more. Just because I really do love some of those paintings that come that you're able to purchase through Amazon. So let me just get all these for the crinkly noise. I'm just getting the plastic off of it. And let me unfurl the painting a bit. Ooh, the plastic feels real nice. I felt it when I was touching it. The canvas is a little rough. Usually a lot of more budget-friendly canvases are like that. Which I don't mind because I do put my paintings on the wall without a frame or anything. So it really helps when, you know, even though they're rubbing a against the paint on the wall it won't damage the canvas i really that's why i'm a big fan of you know some they're a little bit more rough and it comes with the diamonds and your standard kit and just in case you need to diamond painting the standard kit is always your tray your wax and pen and all you would do is pour the diamonds onto the tray get your pen press it on the wax press it on the diamonds press it on the painting and voila you're officially a diamond painter <laughs> and you don't worry in case it breaks you lose it or it runs away from you your next canvas will have a standard kit trust me they always find you <laughs> and these are the diamonds oh my goodness i love the colors i i love this painting because of all the colors when i first saw it and the diamonds are having the same effect as well oh my goodness i love that i love this blue it's such a pretty blue Really nice salmon color. Our lovely 3865. I'm betting that is our color. <laughs> our nice green, this orange. And it's really, really pastel lilac. I'm a big fan of that. Oh, all of these diamonds are really, really pretty. I really like that. And this is the painting. They're wonderful field. I believe they're poppy flowers. I love poppy flowers. So anytime I can see a painting that has this flower on it, I always make sure to you know pick it up and see if there's any other poppy flower paintings as well uh, amazon does that if you purchase or you you have a painting in your cart when you look at the painting it will give you suggestions of oh well if you like this one check out these and they're usually around the same kind of relation to whatever item you're picking for example when i was picking this wonderful painting with poppies it gave me a suggestion of other diamond paintings that have poppies as well. I didn't pick them up at the time, but I think I'm going to go back and look at them again. <laughs> I was just fixing the plastic so you can take care of some of the creases and we can settle the painting down a bit. Oh, it's a lot smaller than I thought. I thought for sure it was a little bit bigger. Huh, I really like this. And you can see the really vibrant red color, the vibrant greens, and that wonderful white background. This is such a pretty painting. Oh, I really like this. And some information about the painting. It is BY by <laughs> triple zero nine and is the 30 by 40 and it only has 23 colors. Oh, huh, I thought it might have been a couple more because I see that there is some confetti around the leaves and on some of the background. It's so pretty. I really like it. And as a little thumbnail, the image, which myself I do reference whenever I'm painting in case I feel one color might be a little off. I used to confirm that, you know, I'm placing the correct color. And for the legend, they are all capitalized letters. Oh, thank goodness. There's no symbols, no numbers. So whatever you see on the drill field, that's what you're going to see on the legend. 
Ooh, big, big fan of that. And it has two of them. It has one on the upper left and one on the lower right. Big fan of it because I've probably stated before. I turn my paintings a lot when I'm painting. So if I ever have to look at the reference real quick. I'm sorry, the legend real quick. It'll be on either side. Big, big fan of that. And the canvas does have, as probably you heard me say, it is a nice quality plastic covering. It's a little thick. And it's not as crinkly as usually the budget friendly paintings have. Oh, apologies. And I really like it. It's real smooth and big, big fan of that. And myself, I do the washi method every now and then, meaning I place the washi tape, cut the little section I'm going to work on, and that's how I keep moving. I have no, I'm not worried if I have to cut through this plastic. As I said, it is really thick and it's really soft and smooth. And I love it when the plastics are like that. The drill field is really clear. That is surprising to me. As you can probably see, I'm trying to get a little closer. The darker colors have a lighter color and the lighter colors have a darker color. As you can see on the white. Oh my goodness, that is real neat. I had noticed how clear it was. It is such a clear drill field. Hmm. Nope, I can't kid up another painting. <laughs> I have so many I'm trying to finish or to complete. I want to finish a couple before the end of the year, which technically I have probably a month and probably a week. <laughs> so I have to get the painting quickly. But this is such a beautiful painting. Oh my goodness, and it's so pretty in person, the way you're seeing it on camera. That's how I'm seeing it in person. I'm a big, big fan of this. And just in case you want some more clarification, I'm going to put a clear image here. Just in case, nice field of poppies is your style as well. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. I really like this. <laughs> oh, one more thing. I forgot. I always forget to check the stick on it. Yep. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> I super lost a fingerprint. <laughs> the stick is really well, so I, I believe any diamonds you're placing, you're not going to have an issue of any falling out. But you can seal the painting once you've completed it. My, myself, I do not. I trust the process. So if I see it's holding on well, it's holding on well. That's the end of the story. <laughs> so yeah, I only have one painting to show. I am do have a couple of paintings I've already I've ordered from Amazon. I have on the side. Stay tuned for that. It'll be a couple more videos in the future. I have ordered a whole bunch of premium paintings. So stay tuned for that as well. I'm going to see if I could probably do two unboxings from when I do receive the paintings. So we can all see them together. And I, I'm really, really excited to see how these paintings come out. So stay tuned for that video as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I said it before, all the information about this will be in the description below. In case a nice field of poppies is your style too. <laughs> and again, if you are a returning viewer, thank you so much for coming back. I really do appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, all I ask is if you can do the usual. If you can like and subscribe, I really appreciate that as well. Really helps me put the channel out there. And it really allows me the opportunity to show all of these wonderful diamond paintings we love to do. Field of flowers and all. <laughs> and again, thank you for your time. And have yourself a wonderful day. Thank you.